What the fu- Yes. This is real. Following the events of the amazing The Pirates in an Adventure with Scientists, Why do I have a rental Blu-ray? comes a new adventure. So you want to be a pirate. Which is basically a parody of everything. Talk shows, the good, the bad, and the ugly, appeals, cooking shows, and Harry Hill's TV burp? Sold as an exclusive DVD to Tesco, a British supermarket with a length of 18 minutes. Well, it's not a movie then. <gasps> the pirate captain introduces himself as the host of a talk show. He reads a letter sent in about a pirate forgetting their buried treasure where the pirate captain explains the simple thing of a map. Pirate number two attempts to dig up some buried treasure and fails. An excellent start. The pirate captain talks about how to sail a boat but gets interrupted when a weevil gets on his biscuit where they have a standoff. Charles Darwin appears to talk about wind measurements that get blown away. Pirate number two tries again to dig up the buried treasure. The captain invites a new recruit of a kidnapped woman. She gets fired out of a cannon. A cooking segment happens about lemon colossal squid. The squid is accidentally put in the washing machine. Pirate number two still attempts to get the buried treasure and fires himself in the air. An appeal ad plays for love and mitosis, causing pirates to be less pirate sounding. The pirate king gets interviewed, leading to... the line. Good guess, but actually no. Wait, what?! The pirate captain tries his beard gel on the pirate king, but accidentally makes his beard green. A song breaks out and everything goes wrong. The end. So, I find this incredibly weird. I mean, yes, it did give us the iconic meme. But this is just such a weird thing. Why would Ardman make this? As a sequel to a movie? I don't get it. It's okay, I guess. Uh... The Shouting! <laughs> the end.